Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm at Montrose Beach. I was doing the drawing from Montrose Pier, which is somewhere in this area. I would have just done the voiceover out there, but it's extremely windy out there. And it's, it's even still windy over here on the beach, but significantly less than out in the water. Very minimal people out here today. Any summertime day, this area is popping off. Literally not a single cloud in the sky. It doesn't get much more beautiful than that. Anyways, today's paper is a grayish green paper. It's actually a lot more green than it looks on camera. And I'm just gonna experiment a little bit today. I'm using a brown brush pen. It's not super dark either. It's very chromatic. It's a very nice color. I figure with the light green maybe some yellow in there some white see how it looks I was sitting with my legs dangling over the edge of this concrete but I was afraid of dropping my camera in the water and you know once the wind started up my pens are rolling all over the place I actually lost one of them in the water anyways Montrose Pier it curves out from the shore and creates kind of a bay in there and I was sitting basically in the middle of that curve I had to move from the edge concrete was getting cold it's starting to give me a little chill up my spine Another Another reason I sat right here in the middle of the curve is because right now I'm facing the sun and I'll be getting all of the direct reflections off of this inner harbor area here. Need that sunlight while you can get it. Be trying every day to be out in the sun as much as I can. I'll show a picture in the video but in real life all of these objects are much farther away than they appear in this drawing. Part of making it a drawing instead of taking a photograph is to make it ideal. Resize things a bit so they seem a bit more pleasing and entertaining to look at. This beach is part sand, part concrete. Most beaches are one or the other, but this one's got both. In fact, it's got more than both. It's got multi-species. We got the dog beach on the northern end. We got the human beach right here in the middle. And then we have the bird beach. This is the bird sanctuary. There's a lot of trees, designated paths, a lot of keeping the humans from tampering with the birds. I've seen so many varieties of birds out here. It's incredible. I have videos of some of them. I'll see what I can find to include in this video but no promises when you're facing the Sun you can feel that warmth you can feel that that yellow and so I'm gonna bring in some of that yellow into this drawing just purely to exemplify the warmth. I'm gonna do that up in the sky where the Sun actually is and then I'm gonna have some of the reflections on the inner cove of this pier I am gonna bring the white presto back in here and so it goes over anything in one pass one try anyways I'm gonna use the white presto to add highlights on a lot of these things also so this white dome structure here is actually a kayak and canoe rental spot. A good friend of mine, Rex, he works there. I go down and rent paddle boards from him. I'm kind of surprised Rex ain't out here today. Temperature don't matter for him. He's on the water all the time. 29 drawings deep. 30 is quickly approaching and 50 will be here before you know it. I have some trips coming up, so let's take this show on the road, get some drawings coming from outside of the shy. I'm hoping to get in several more while it's warm, warm enough. I am trying to make it happen while I can. Live from Montrose Beach, live from Montrose Harbor, live from Montrose Pier. I'm OJ, Juice Loops Live. I'll catch you next week. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> oh, boy. People staring, people gawking, people laughing, people mocking. But hey, it is what it is, and here we are. They don't know. They don't want to know. Maybe they do. I'll send them a link. I thought I recognized that bike, Rex.